hao wa mama wamekuwa na ujaziri kubwa sana Religious leaders in Isiola County have made an appeal to members of the various pastoralist communities who were predominant in the region to embrace diversification of their source of livelihood. The move is aimed at reducing over-reliance on livestock and consequently discourage the age-old practice of cattle rustling where communities raid other communities in a bit to restock especially after drought seasons. While communicating their resolutions and recommendations following a dialogue and mediation for peace and cohesion forum convened by the National Council of Churches of Kenya, the Kenya Conference of Catholic Bishops and the Supreme Council of Kenya Muslims, the chairperson of NCCK, Isiolo Chapter, Reverend Nathan Mangi, said that there was need for proper sensitization of members of pastoralist communities to adopt other ventures that will provide alternative source of income. To empower the youth and build a foundation for lasting peace, the council proposes community socialization initiatives. This involves organizing peace sports tournaments and marathons and providing platform for networking, youth engagement and mentorship. Lastly, the NCCK calls upon the national and county governments, as well as independent electoral and boundaries commission, IBC, to swiftly address and resolve boundary conflicts between Isio County and its neighboring counties. Such resolution is essential for maintaining peace and stability in the region. Sisi kama KCCB, NCCK na Supkem to Mexicana, pia tutendelea kwa mazisha watu makanisani, pamoja kwa misikitini ili vijana wetu wapate kuishi kwa amani wapate kutafuta njia nyingine ambayo wanaweza kujikimu na kujiendelesha kimaisha jambo ambalo linatuangamiza sisi kama jamii ya Isiolo tunaweza kulipata suluhu yake kwa haraka kwa kuwa sisi tunata sisi wote tunataka maendeleo ya hii kaunti yetu Now get this, more than 380 million tons of plastics are produced 